Hello, hello, hello gaming nerds. It's Friday. Hope your five senses work. Hope your health and strength is good. Another beautiful day. Yeah! <laughs> remember when I was talking to you about Game Pass, right? <laughs> remember I told you that remember I told you that I told you I said don't be surprised when you see Epic and Steam comes to Game Pass, right? You thought I was joking, right? <laughs> Game Pass is a problem, man. Okay? Game Pass is no joke. Microsoft got that title, and Game Pass is no joke. Listen to this. Epic Game Store is coming to Windows Store. Let me say this again. Epic Game Store is coming to Windows Store. Epic Games, okay? Says you with the... With the opening of Microsoft Windows Store to third-party application stores, Epic Game Store is set set to come to the platform. It says here, Microsoft Windows Store is a digital distribution platform that allows users to buy and download various games. A few months ago, the Windows Storefront was completely reworked with overall improving, improvements given to its UI user interface and apps submission policies. The store has received several updates over the years when it released for Windows 10. With the latest update being one of the biggest, the latest change allowed for third-party applications to be integrated into storefronts, which includes other storefronts. This change is supported with the fact that the Epic Game Store will be coming to this open platform because of Game Pass. Boy, Game Pass is no joke. Anyway. Epic Game Store is a PC gaming distribution giant with a free game is given out for players to download and claim for a limited time. This occurs every week with next week's Epic Game Store freebie revealed recently as well. It is a service that has quite a lot of value considering that no subs subscription fees are required to maintain membership with the service with the platform also adding more free games every week with Microsoft allowing for third-party stores to be a part of the platform. The Epic Game Store is one of the first supporters of this change alongside, alongside Amazon. Hmm. Says here the general manager of Windows Store, Gary Gold As Asardo, explained that Epic Game Store and Amazon storefront will be available as apps that are much like the ones currently on the platform and will have their own products detail page. This includes the ability to find and install the application using Windows Store in the same vein as other utility or entertainment apps on there. The news of this platform opening up for third parties store was celebrated by Epic Games CEO Tim Sweeney who posted about the news on Twitter. And then, he's, then it shows the tweet here and then keep going here so I'm, I'm almost done it says the reaction to the store coming to the service has been rather mixed based on the response to Sweeney's announcement some fans were skeptical of this with some expressing their opinions on this being a bad move while others were open and open open and accepting of this some even brought up the court case between Apple and Epic games from earlier this year where the partnership wouldn't need to need for cuts and allow for third-party payments option. Regardless, this announcement will see the Epic Games Store come into Microsoft service in the near future, though there hasn't been a set date outlined yet. <laughs> this open platform could be even see other services like Steam be added in the future, as Microsoft more open store app policies have been popular apps like Discord, Zoom, and even Reddit listed in the Windows Store. And that is that. Microsoft is just making moves, man. And um, I told you guys that don't be surprised if you see Epic and Steam come to come to Game Pass, man. I, I, I knew when Game Pass, when Microsoft, when that ZeniMax Bethesda deal happened. I, 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 and um, Game Pass was, I knew that Microsoft was going to be a problem when it came when it came to Game Pass and that Zenimax Bethesda deal, and I said to people like, "Look, don't be surprised if you see Epic Games come into Microsoft." And look what's happening now. Okay. So anyway, what I'm gonna do is this: I'm gonna leave a link in the description box with this article, 
So y'all can look at it. Nice talking to you people again. Chris, still a Star Wars and Star Trek thing. Borg, Dark Side. I'm gone. Peace.